host range of plasmids that when plasmids they are present in microbes so whether they have narrow host range or wide host range so plasmid in, uh, usually encodes a few proteins that are necessary for its replication and other proteins that are mainly the enzymes like DNA polymerases, helicases or even ligases they are provided by the host organisms and those proteins that are encoded by plasmid for its own replication uh, those genes that are present very near to the ORI region are region of replication ORI or region of replication it is the point where DNA replication it mainly starts so those genes that encode proteins for plasmid replication they reside very close to the origin of replication so one can say that the essential genes for DNA replication they are present very near to the origin of replication and other part of the plasmid it is not required for plasmid replication so we can delete those part of the plasmid that are not required for DNA replication and can replace it with foreign DNA or gene of interest so now we can say that the host range of plasmid it is mainly determined by its origin of replication so I can quote one example of the plasmid like coal E1 it is having restricted host range and it can uh, transfer with an a few enteric uh, bacteria like gram negative uh, E. coli or the salmonella or shigella whereas other plasmid like RP4 and RS RSF1010 they are having slightly broad host range for example RP4 it can be transferred uh, in variety of gram negative bacteria so DNA can be transferred from one gram negative bacteria to another gram negative bacteria that are more or less taxonomically related Jabke jo dusri example hai RSF1010 ki to ye jo plasmid hai is ki host range comparatively zyada hai kyunke ye gram negative se gram positive may be shift ho sakta hai so the, uh, so the transfer of DNA it is from uh, within gram positive or gram negative so other plasmids that are isolated from uh, gram positive bacteria like the Staphylococcus aureus they are also having a broad host range because they can transfer between variety of gram positive bacteria overall we can say that the host range of the plasmid it is determined by its origin of replication and if plasmid it is having more genes or uh, that can encode variety of proteins that mediate its replication then the host range of the plasmid it is comparatively broad